I recently heard a minister say that President Trump is not in the White House now because of arrogance and too many tweets. Hello, I'm Ron Edwards on today's page from the Edwards Notebook. So is arrogancy in tweets now more egregious than the United States under the Biden doctrine of forcing nations around the world to accept U.S. taxpayer dollars to promote and fund abortions? Stop the construction of our southern border wall, block deportation of illegal border crossers, and allow them to roam throughout our republic? Hmm? Rejoin the World Health Organization, the commitment to rejoin the horribly expensive Iran nuclear arms deal, end the Muslim travel ban, force schools to allow transgenders to participate in girls' sports, reverse transgender military bans, and stick taxpayers with the cost of paying for transgender operations, re-enter Paris Climate Accords that could help decimate our ability to remain energy independent and allows China to pollute at will. Biden's commitment to fast-track DACA and give millions of illegal border crossers citizenship and amnesty? I don't know about you, but I believe Biden's agenda will soon prove much worse than Trump's alleged arrogancy and tweets. I'm Ron Edwards. Check out the RonEdwards.com. Ron Edwards, the new voice of America. Sponsored by the Tri-County Liberty Coalition.